for enterprises to be able to adapt to the changes ahead, they do need to prepare their employees for the breadth of business transformation, transformation around understanding technology changes, and transformation around mindset and nimbleness to be able to adjust to change. One of our missions is to bring research and teaching that is happening at Stanford to working professionals outside of Stanford. Personally, my research focuses on the effects of technology on teams, collaboration, and innovation. We began doing custom education around 30 years ago, which didn't include online education at the time, but now includes all of these wonderful tools, technologies, and capabilities that can accelerate impact for organizations. In the future, will AI be so smart it won't need human input? That's a good question. What we do when we work with enterprises is we try to look at the various challenges that they're facing and think about ways that education can help them be better equipped to work through those challenges. And so if we've done our job, when we've delivered an education program, we leave and you're fully equipped to execute and solve on the challenges ahead of you. The most expensive way to prepare is to actually go through a real-life crisis. We have at our disposal this huge array of educational opportunities that range from doing a full master's degree all the way through to doing a one-hour webinar. I'm Stanford professor Will Tarpe, and in my new course, I will demystify the world of water management and chemical manufacturing. Together, we'll explore the promise of circular economies and reveal the pivotal roles that water plays from producing fuels and fertilizers to making the very water that we consume every day. The School of Engineering at Stanford has faculty who are researching the intersection of science, engineering, and business practice. And that combination is what is absolutely necessary for the future of work. The success of your product and your team relies upon you understanding these important concepts. That requires different industries to really develop new ways of thinking, new language, new cultures that need to be adopted across the entire organization, not just by one business unit, not just by the senior leadership team, but by the entire enterprise. <laughs>